Okay, so the bottom is not factored. Let's factor the, the greatest common factors from these two terms. Constant wise 5, A, 4 versus 2, so the greatest common factor is 2. B is 1 versus 2, so it's just 1. So you're going to get a 3A squared minus 2. A squares are all taken away. 1B is taken away, so we have a B here. So 5 gets reduced, B gets reduced. We have A over A squared is A times A. It's reduced again, and we're done. Okay, but we have to get the restriction, and with restriction, we get it from expression where uh, we do any reducing. So we get it from here, and A clearly cannot be zero, neither can B. And from here, we have 3A squared minus 2B cannot be zero. Or we can say 2B cannot be 3a squared or b cannot be 3 over 2. Right? If you want one variable as a function of the other variable. Okay, these are all same same thing. Okay, but this is probably the most preferred answer for the restriction.